Sunday night marked the 94th Academy Awards and the show was anything but boring. I was lucky enough to sit down and talk about the unforgettable Oscar ceremony with our film reporter Alexa LaMalfa and all the way from LA our award show reporter Katie Lane. Zoom with Katie Lane all the way from LA who had her own little inside look into the Oscars and of course our film reporter Alexa LaMalfa. So Katie you had a pretty crazy experience so I've heard so can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah for sure. Um, I, I was actually able to score credentials to um, the Oscars virtual press room which was a really cool experience for a student journalist um, and I was able to sit in and get like a, a inside look on the award winners after they won their award, their interviews um, that they gave. That is so cool. So can you guys give me a little recap of the night? Absolutely. It was a crazy night. Um, we're gonna break it all down, but first shout out to this year's uh, Academy producers because it was insane. Um, executive producer Will Packer handled everything that was thrown his way. He promised a few weeks ago that the show was going to be exciting and I think he delivered. Alexa, what did you think? I absolutely agree. I think this is a definitely a shift towards the entertainment side of the Oscars than what we've ever seen before. Yeah. Um, let's start off with the red carpet. Uh, my favorite look had to be Lily James. Um, she just came off of Pam and Tommy. She was um, one of the announcers for the evening, one of the presenters. Um, she had this beautiful blush gown on and it inspi inspired my look for, for, the, uh, for tonight. Um, <laughs> and blush was really the color of the Oscars. Um, there was also uh, lots of musical events. Like, so what was your favorite? I think we have to talk about Bruno. Bru we don't talk about Bruno. The first ever live performance was absolutely incredible. I loved Megan Thee Stallion's incoming verse on it. I thought it was really cool. Yeah, no, love, love the special guests. And, and the hosts were amazing. Um, Amy Schumer, Regina King, and Wanda Sykes, they did little skits throughout the night. It was funny. They did a good job. And there wasn't too much involvement. So it was a nice way to ease back into having a host after not having one for the last few years. Definitely. And I'm not going to get too far into the Will Smith situation because at this point, I'm sure everyone's heard about that, but pretty, pretty crazy, right? Oh, it's been the talk of the town for sure. Uh, everything I see on social media, absolutely insane. For those who don't know, um, Will Smith slapped Chris Rock after he told um, a joke about his wife and told him to keep his wife's name out of his mouth and all this crazy stuff. But it was, it was insane for sure, for yeah. sure. We've all heard about the Will Smith situation, but can you tell us a little bit about, you know, some of the bigger moments in the awards, anything that may have made history? Oh, this, this ceremony was history making for sure. It's going to go down in the books. Um, first off, Troy Coetzer, um, he won uh, Best Supporting Actor for uh, his work in CODA. Um, he was the first deaf man to win an Oscar. Absolutely amazing. It like was such a moving, um, being able to see that was was so moving. Um, Coda itself uh, was the first streamer to ever win Best Picture. Um, so watch out, Netflix, Apple TV is is on the rise with their 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 films here. Um, on other award winners making history, we had Ariana DeBose. Uh, she actually took home the first award of the night. Uh, she is the first openly queer Afro Latina to win um, Best Supporting Actress and. Um, for her role as um, in West Side Story. Um, Thank yeah, you. I don't know. What, what did you think, Alexa? Any, any moments that made history for you? Uh, going along with the West Side Story, I think this is the second Anita actress to win a Best Supporting Actress for her role as Anita. So I thought that was really cool. Well, thank you so much for joining us today, Katie and Alexa. It was amazing hearing your special take on the Oscars and your commentary as well. So thank you again for being here. Thanks for having me.